Mr. Garage here. We're going to talk about spark plugs for your 7590 115 horsepower Mercury outboard, the new 2.1 liter series. Um, the factory plugs, they work fine. You're not going to have a problem with them. Most major manufacturers have all switched over to Iridium plugs. Why? Not because it nets more horsepower or because it's going to do anything miraculous for the motor, but because Iridium lasts an extremely long time. You're going to get about three times the life out of them, but they do cost about three times the price. Um, Iridium also is a fine wire electrode, so the geek speak is that uh, there's no spark blowout with it. So you actually can run a wider gap and it's not going to hurt anything. A V-Power has a 0 0.032 gap. The um, NGK Iridium version spark plug for this motor is going to have a 0 0.044 gap from memory. So the factory plug is a, let's see here, it's a ZFR5F. Now the Iridium, you have the same part number, ZFR5FIX. And then dash 11. The dash 11 means a 0 0.044 gap. Do not adjust this gap. Leave it exactly as it is. Plug it in this motor and it's probably going to last the life of the boat. That's that's the beautiful, beautiful part about Iridium. Now I've got both plugs here in front of me. And uh, I barely, barely use the factory plug. I just tore them out. I do it almost on all my equipment because Iridium, the other benefit to Iridium is usually a quicker start to a motor. So um, I didn't notice any difference in the start on this outboard. Again, the factory plugs are fine, but if it's time to change out plugs, go to the Iridium, Iridium plugs and you won't be sorry. Just, you know, they're plug and play. They're an awesome plug. They're gonna last forever. Installing your spark plugs is easy. So they have a gasket, a crush gasket on each plug. Now, NGK's recommendation is a half turn to two thirds of a turn. Mercury says 20 foot pounds. I prefer just doing the turn method. So I'm sitting about here with my wrench and I'm gonna crank it over and tighten it. And I'm gonna go about to there. That is my half turn and that's gonna crush and seat the gasket properly for this particular spark plug. When installing your spark plug boot back onto the end of your plug, Mercury has their own kind of grease. It's a green color grease. Don't know what the heck it is. It's just their spark plug grease. I use just a silicone dielectric. I got a lot of these little packets. I use a silicone dielectric, coat the inside of the boot, and I coat the outside of the plug, and that prevents the plug wire from getting stuck on the plug itself. So that, that is something you need to do. Make sure they're greased up before you put the boot back on. Once you have the boot all greased up and you go to put it on, you're gonna put your thumb or hand at the end of the plug wire and you're gonna push until you feel or hear a click. Don't just shove it on there and think you're good or that plug wire is gonna fall off. So we're gonna push, that's it. We have our little click and we are on and that plug wire is seated. All right, this wraps up the spark plug video. Uh, one last little note, spark plug wires, you ever need to change those, wires just go down inside the cowl. They come around up top here. Uh, we got coil packs behind this cover. So if you ever need to change a coil pack, they're there as well. So you're gonna use the same grease inside these little um, boots if you ever have to change those out. But yeah, thanks for watching. My channel is totally random. There, there's just tons of weird stuff on my channel. I'm just gonna keep doing videos of stuff that I do every day because I do a lot of random things. So uh, yeah, if you like my videos, subscribe and hope to see you guys in the water. Mr. Garage here. I wanted to close out the video really fast with a promotion about my t-shirt and the organization that that t-shirt came from, Cast for Kids. If you guys have a boat and it's safe and you have the time, look up to see if there is a Cast for Kids event in your area. You're not going to be sorry. They, it's just an amazing experience. They put on a heck of an event and um, it's going to get kids out, get them fishing, doing things that, that they may never have the chance to do again. But again, I'm just promoting them cast for kids any of my boating videos i'm going to try to end the video with this little promotion but uh seriously guys look it up online cast for kids